Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, Throne and Liberty News. Let's check what is happening on servers in Korea and regarding global release of Throne and Liberty. Before we start, let me just say subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more of Throne and Liberty videos in the future. First, let's start with news from Korea. In front of you, you can see brand new update from April 17. Let's check content of this new update over there on servers in Korea, publisher, actually developer of this game, NCSoft, is still polishing the game. You can see here they are doing some changes regarding weapon appearance. This is regarding uh, longbow. What else? Actually, this is interesting. Weather changes. This is very important feature of Throne and Liberty. I'm preparing special video regarding weather changes in this game because there is a huge change not only regarding skills of your weapons but also regarding environment regarding entry conditions to open world dungeons like sanctum of desire when it's raining for example so we have here change the weather schedule for Raslan and Stoneguard have been changed to be the same now when it rains in Raslan it also rains in Stoneguard this is very good change you know why because map of throne and liberty is divided i mean it's not physically divided but it's divided into two regions on the left we have raslan on the west side and on the east side we have stone guard and very often very often it happens actually that we have opposite kind of weather in these two regions so for example when it's raining in raslan in stone guard region it's not raining it's sunny weather and opposite where it's raining in stone guard or there in raslan it's sunny weather that is very important you need to check it's very confusing right and uh, especially if you play on especially if you play on few different characters right then you need to run to another part of the map so this is very positive change when it will rain it will rain all over the map it will not be divided on the east and western part of the map very good change a party when party matchmaking is completed and waiting for acceptance the waiting time has been changed from 60 seconds to 30 seconds okay this is good and then we have some uh, correction of content errors nothing too important actually here again some changes regarding uh, regarding uh, appearance of your character look at this right looking absolutely amazing skins in throne and liberty but actually nothing too huge i will show you we are getting uh, in a second i will show you a brand new video regarding new skins of throne and liberty and we have some new events this is it regarding patch notes however the biggest change is actually announced for april 25th this is very important so big changes are coming to boomstone system in the previous let's say currently in the game we have zerg situation on these origin stones and imagine stones in the future this should be one versus one guild pvp situation and this is this is very good change right so ncsoft is still polishing changing adjusting this guild versus guild pvp which is very important part of the content of throne and liberty and looks like it will be in the future one versus one maybe even like instance completely you'll be you'll be transferred into different part of the map right and that's it one versus one guild pvp amazing idea right we need to see how this work out i will check it out on servers in korea i'm still playing and i will continue to play on servers in korea until we get global release of throne and liberty check my live streams on twitch i am live streaming every evening mandatory every evening no skipping about 6 p.m central european time join me on twitch if you have any kind of questions regarding the game i'll be glad to answer and like i said in the future when we get this new feature on april 25th i will check it out how this work out uh they are still adjusting they are still adjusting this uh, guild versus guild content and this is looking like one this is looking like one very positive change whatever they are changing what is moving away from zerg kind of system you know what i mean one versus one sounds really good regarding guild versus guild and also i want to change uh, here i want to show you actually here for this evening uh, this is a video presenting brand new skins uh, which are implemented into the game uh basically uh, this evening no actually it's coming uh, tomorrow on servers in korea uh we have here new skins for uh, costumes and for your weapons let's check it out this is very short video from ncsoft presenting these new skins throne and liberty have many beautiful skins for your armor and weapon this will be one very nice addition to those skins we can see here gs greatsword a longbow 
and also costumes right are new we have here stuff oh shield is looking great right we have seen here shield let's go a little bit back stuff is looking amazing but shield look at this right shields swords great swords are looking always the best at least in my opinion right great sword sword and shield stuff also but you know what on the end absolutely all of the weapons in throne and liberty are looking amazing so brand new skins they have had uh, lots of skins lately almost with every new patch we are getting over there on service in korea uh, brand new skins which is very nice i know that many players enjoy this part of the gameplay in, in mmorpgs right you want to you want to decorate your character looking very nice and regarding the colors for every skin you can change costume color as as much as you want right different parts of the costumes even and uh, it's looking really good so brand new skin and brand new skin for weapon and costume regarding a service of, or in korea right over there and regarding global version of the game of course i need to mention a uh, still no release date still no release date nothing officially from amazon games but probably you know that if you're following my youtube channel currently we have actually today is the last day of global closed beta i cannot comment i cannot say anything regarding content of the global closed beta because nda was up that means no live streams no videos and also no any kind of comments or talking about global closed beta i can only tell you it's a public it's official information that global closed beta is uh, finishing today you can see here april 17 a uh, closing ceremony probably when you are watching this video Video, uh, on my youtube channel there will be closing ceremony up and uh, this is one huge step forward into direction of release of throne and liberty when nobody knows it's very hard to say but now we are waiting now we are waiting for global announcement for global release date from amazon games if i'm guessing right my guess purely my guess I think that uh, that will happen very soon. When I see any kind of new information regarding global release date or something interesting is happening over there on servers in Korea, I will let you know about that instantly here on my YouTube channel within different kind of videos. If you are interested into this new upcoming PC MMORPG, also available one day in the future on PlayStation 5 and Xbox, check my YouTube channel. I already have 200 videos. 200 guides, news, updates, reviews, different kind of videos regarding this new upcoming title. And I'm preparing lots of guides also for global release of this title. You can find here on my YouTube channel different kind of videos, not only news and updates, also many guides regarding different kind of in-game systems of Throne and Liberty. There are many different kind of in-game systems, PvP-wise, PvE-wise, crafting, uh, PV dungeons, single player dungeons, uh, party dungeons, guild versus guild content massive sieges all of these guides you can check on my youtube channel and like i have said i'm preparing lots of guides for global release of throne and liberty you'll be updated regarding everything what is happening with this new upcoming pc mmorpg thank you for watching the video subscribe to my youtube channel follow me on twitch and see you soon with another throne and liberty video